Hello, dear. Um, I'm talking very quietly because I know you're hungover. I told you not to drink, but you did. No, this is an Irish coffee. Listen, I can tell you not to drink, but you can't tell me not to drink. I'm not an alcoholic. Um, so, anyways, look what you did last night. This is the light switch to the bathroom. You took it off. But, at least I have a magnet. Look. Uh, anyways, that's not the point of me coming out here. This would be a good weapon. Smack, smack. Just kidding. I didn't really hit you. Don't call the cops. So. Oh yeah. I have a giant spoon in here. A tablespoon. I don't know why. No, not a spoon that belongs at the table. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is one of the many reasons why I think we should get a divorce. Yeah, I'm completely serious. I know I smiled and it didn't seem serious, but I'm serious. Well, I mean, you just spent $50,000 gambling and lost it all, so you know, that kind of... That's not really something a wife likes. Um, but yeah, I, I think we should get a divorce. The kids, we don't have kids. Oh, the dog and the cat. Well, you can keep the cat. I'm, I'm over him now. He's too mean. But I'll take the rest. Okay, fine. I'll take the cat too. Yeah, listen. You know, this is a long time in the making. I mean, after our honeymoon, uh, no, our actual honeymoon, not the honeymoon phase. We went to, um, Boca. I don't even know where that is, but I hear it a lot on TV. And you said, oh, let's go to Boca. So we did, and I got kidnapped for the three days, and you didn't even pay the ransom. I knew, I knew that was a risk, so that's kind of my fault, but... I knew that was a risk when I married a wealthy businessman, but you could have at least paid the ransom. Do you know, do you know what they did to me? They made me watch a bunch of YouTube videos all in a row that were all the exact same genre. It was the toy unboxing videos, and I, I don't like those. They just had me watch it repeatedly, and you didn't pay the ransom. That was just like some weird, weird form of torture, but it worked. <sighs> mm, they're Sharpies. I don't know where pins are. Yes, but anyways, I want a divorce. Especially after the kidnapping thing. I'm signing the divorce paper. What? They'll accept it in Sharpie. They accept it in, like, crayon. I don't see why they want to accept it in Sharpie. What's the date? Alright, you don't want to tell me it's the 4th. I know what day it is. Well, it's not just the whole kidnapping ordeal. Even though, you know, that was kind of the biggest part of me wanting to, a divorce. The gambling's also not very good. Yeah, if you, if you stop gambling, we can make the turtle cage and the swimming people's cage a lot quieter. Do you know how expensive it is to upkeep reptiles? And of course you don't. You don't help me with anything. It doesn't matter that we have a maid, okay? Yeah, and Denise, the maid, by the way, stole my candle. That's another issue. Look, I can't even draw a heart right anymore. Because you, you, <laughs> you broke it.
Oh, great. See, that's why you can keep the cat. I don't know what their problem is. They're going to come and take the uh, Sharpie or drink my coffee when they do. Anyways, yeah, I think a divorce is what we need. Dear Lord, it sounded like somebody was breaking in. Well, I don't know. Listen, stop worrying about what I'm doing, okay? I'm doing my own stuff over here. Well, it's not really fun asking for a divorce to someone. No, there's not another man. And no, there's not another woman. I knew you were going to ask that next. I swear. See, my mother always said, well, my mother always said, marry him, he's really rich, and I want to retire in style, but that wasn't what, what I was going to say. My mother always said, once a annoying gambling addict, alcoholic, always an annoying gambling addict, alcoholic. You want the ring back? Look how nice that ring is. I want it. Fine. You can have any of the rings, I guess. No, no, I understand. Not many people want to give their ex-wives rings. No, I'm not doing anything. No, I, I didn't just take it back. Anyways. You got me an empty box that was with that do not eat stuff in it. Okay. But, you thought this would win me over? I mean, it's a cute box, but, you know, doesn't really take back anything that happened. No, you see, the kidnapping thing wasn't really that big of an issue. I mean, I guess getting kidnapped isn't that fun, but, you know, I knew the risk when I decided to marry you. But, I think the main reason is that, um, one, you didn't pay the ransom, and two, you made me sign a prenub for our wedding. Yeah, jeez, I'm not getting any of your money. Do you not know what a prenub is? Uh-oh, the cat was trying to eat the do not eat stuff. Yeah, I signed a prenub. No, you don't have to give me any of the money. I mean, it would be nice. It would be a nice gift. Hmm? No, I, that, was, that was more the do not eat stuff. I broke the lid. <sighs> I always knew you were... Ow. Knew you were nice. So you are going to give me some of the money? That's so sweet of you. See, if this was how you always act, then I wouldn't be asking for a divorce. I wrote my own name wrong already, I forgot. A U. Oops. And then I wrote the wrong date. Let me try again. <laughs> you think I'm just doing this to stall, but I'm really not. I wrote 41 instead of 4. I think I have brain damage. There we go. Alright. Now you just need to sign. <laughs> um, you want help? Okay. I'll sign for you. Wow, this is really hard. <laughs> um, what 
What's your last name? Oh yeah, I remember. I didn't take your last name. Remember. Mm. Oh, I messed up. It's okay. No one will know. This is a lot of work. It just looks like you signed it when you were very drunk. Hang on. Let me fold up my half. Let's see. Look. <laughs> James Myers. <laughs> I gotta say, I am a wonderful pinman from above. Anyways. I got one more thing I need you to agree on. So... Oh, yeah, they don't have words, but trust me, they're divorce papers. Oh, my handwriting is terrible, but don't worry. I'm writing so fast. It's terrible in general. I don't know why I felt like I needed to lie to you. You know my handwriting. No, it's weird. Um, my handwriting is atrocious, and I don't really know why, because I even went to, well, it wasn't penmanship school, but we had penmanship classes. But, um, it never helped. Um, yeah, I don't, I'll just sign for you. I wrote 41 again. I'll just erase it. There you go. Aurora and James have signed. What do you mean, is that my real name? Are, are you joking? Oh, sorry. I hit the cat. But are you joking? Yes, that's my real name. What, what sort of question is that? Did you not know my whole name this whole time we've been married? Wow. Wow, we got There's two pieces of paper under there. Hang on. Anyways, let me show you one more thing. Uh, this isn't related to our divorce, but I just want to show you something. Watch. <laughs> You're going to be very amazed. At how good I do this bubble up letter. I drew a really good straight line. Look, that is a good looking F, huh? No, I'm not gonna type or er, type write anything mean. What's your problem? Mm, I messed up. It's okay. It's okay. Mm. Well, let's turn it. <laughs> um. Now it's a. Now it's a six. You like it? <laughs> Alright. Anyways, I hope that lightened up your mood from finding out you're going to get a divorce. You can keep that, by the way. I'll sign it. You want it signed so you can sell it? Because, you know, that is like a, a work of art. Sounds like there's zombies outside or something. There's not, obviously, but it sounds like it. I hope one of the neighbors didn't come on the porch and, like, fall. It's probably just murder. I made the last part where you can't read it. And let me just, let me just write one thing to you. I'm just kidding. I'm not going to show you what I wrote. No, I wrote something mean. Um, it says, um, communist. No, no, I, I didn't write communist. Um, anyways. I'm going to, uh, I guess pack up my things. 
And you know what? I'm gonna go back to Boca, look for those kidnappers. Maybe, maybe one of them wants to marry me. Okay, bye. Well, not bye yet. I'm gonna be here for a little bit. Ow, my god, the cat just bit me. Okay, now goodbye for now.